everything. I, I guess that's what it's trying to say, is we're trying to preserve organic life and so, so it doesn't all become synthetic. But, I, I don't know, it starts to make sense, I suppose. I'm not as mad. But that whole Citadel and Chris, uh, Catalyst thing pisses me off. Like, oh, the Citadel isn't the Catalyst. I'm the Catalyst. The Citadel is part of me. Doesn't that make you fucking... That makes it the Catalyst. <laughs> like, what the fuck? All right, anyways, how is this not conflict? Because, yeah, exactly. The Reapers are killing us, so synthetics... I don't know. I kind of I kind of get it now. Reapers are just killing off those who are too evolved. And they're leaving behind all the ones that are unevolved, you know? Like... Like, uh, forest animals. <laughs> Bambi. All the deers, you know? They're not gonna kill that shit. They're just gonna kill humans because we're already evolved in. <sighs> I don't know. I'm trying to- I'm trying to understand the ending. We're at war with the Reapers right now. You may be in conflict with the Reapers, but they are not interested in war. I find that hard to believe. When fire burns, is it at war? Is it in conflict? Or is it simply doing what it was created to do? We are no different. We harvest your bodies, your knowledge, your creations. We preserve it to be reborn in the form of- a Now what? What is fucking happening? Oh my god. Are you fucking kidding me with this goddamn shit? Alright, so apparently, um... <laughs> my internet connection dropped to my house. Which, in turn, means no DLC for me, which is great. So, I had to wait a good hour before the internet came back. Ugh, let's try this again. We're at war with the Reapers right now. You may be in conflict with the Reapers, but they are not interested in war. I find that hard to believe. When fire burns, is it at war? Is it in conflict? Or is it simply doing what it was created to do? We are no different. We harvest your bodies, your knowledge, your creations. We preserve it to be reborn in the form of a new reaper. Like a cleansing fire, we restore balance. New life, both organic and synthetic, can once again flourish. Okay, tell me about the catalyst. You said you're the catalyst. What are you? A construct, an intelligence designed eons ago to solve a problem. I was created to bring balance, to be the catalyst for peace between organics and synthetics. So you're just an AI? In as much as you are just an animal, I embody the collective intelligence of all Reapers. But you were created. Correct. By who? What? By ones who recognized that conflict would always arise between synthetics and organics. I was first created to oversee the relations between synthetic and organic life, to establish a connection. But our efforts always ended in conflict, so a new solution was required. The Reapers? Precisely. I just Google searched on my phone what an eon is, and apparently this guy says it's 1.5 billion years. Hang on. This other guy says it's 550 million years, so there's kind of a difference, but like in answers, I really don't know what the right answer is to that, how long an eon is, but it's fucking old. So they have had well over a million years. Um, that's when the Reapers were created or whatever. So, uh... So, I don't know if you guys know what a controlled fire, forest fire is. It's where the forest floor is filled up with dead shit, alright? And it's stopping the growth of the forest. So, what people do uh, is they'll actually control the fire. They'll start a fire in the forest and they'll control it. They do it a lot over here in America. I don't know about other countries, but especially out west, they'll do it. Controlled forest. Controlled burning. I don't know what they really call it. But uh, they burn all the shit off the forest floor. And um, it'll actually grow back pretty damn quick like within a few years it's already fully grown back so that's what the reapers are doing they're they're controlling the organic life they're making it so synthetics can't just you know rule us if we build c3po and he has a, a crazy ego and wants to kill everything we won't be able to stop him so uh the reapers 
coming and kill all those who are too advanced. And the cycle continues and continues and continues. What do you know about the Crucible? The device you refer to as the Crucible is little more than a power source. However, in combination with the Citadel and the Relays, it is capable of releasing tremendous amounts of energy throughout the galaxy. It is crude, but effective and adaptive in its design. Who designed it? You would not know them, and there is not enough time to explain. We first noted the concept for this device several cycles ago. With each passing cycle, the design has no doubt evolved. Why didn't you stop it? We believe the concept had been eradicated. Clearly, organics are more resourceful than we realized. We're just trying to survive. But you're taking away our future. Without a future, we have no hope. Without hope, we might as well be machines. Programmed to do what we're told. You have hope. More than you think. The fact that you were standing here, the first organic ever, proves it. But it also proves my solution won't work anymore. Huh. So now what? We find a new solution. Why are you telling me this? Why help me? You have altered the variables. What do you mean? The Crucible changed me, created new possibilities, but I can't make them happen. If there is to be a new solution, you must act. It is now in your power to destroy us. But be warned, others will be destroyed as well. The Crucible will not discriminate. All synthetics will be targeted. Even you are partly synthetic. What exactly will happen? Your Crucible device appears to be largely intact. However, the effects of the blast will not be constrained to the Reapers. Technology you rely on will be affected. But those who survive should have little difficulty repairing the damage. There will still be losses, but no more than what has already been lost. But the Reapers will be destroyed? Yes, but the peace won't last. Soon, your children will create synthetics, and then the chaos will come back. There has to be another way. There is. You could instead use the energy of the Crucible to seize control of the Reapers. Isn't that what the elusive man wanted? Yep. So... The elusive man was right after all. Yes, but he could never have taken control. Because we already controlled him. But I can. You will die. You will control us, but you will lose everything you have. How can I control the Reapers if I'm dead? Your corporeal form will be dissolved, but your thoughts and even your memories will continue. You will no longer be organic. Your connection to your kind will be lost, though you will remain aware of their existence. But the Reapers will obey me? Yes. We will be yours to control and direct as you see fit. Hmm. There is another solution. Synthesis. And that is? Add your energy to the Crucibles. The chain reaction will combine all synthetic and organic life into a new framework. A new DNA. Explain how my energy can be added to the Crucible. Your organic energy, the essence of who and what you are, will be broken down and then dispersed. To 
do what, exactly? The energy of the Crucible, released in this way, will alter the matrix of all organic life in the galaxy. Organics seek perfection through technology. Synthetics seek perfection through understanding. Organics will be perfected by integrating fully with synthetic technology. Synthetics, in turn, will finally have full understanding of organics. It is the ideal solution. Now that we know it is possible, it is inevitable we will reach synthesis. Why couldn't you do it sooner? We have tried a similar solution in the past. But it has always failed. Why? Because the organics were not ready. It is not something that can be forced. You are ready, and you may choose it. I... don't know. Why not? Synthetics are already part of you. Can you imagine your life without them? And there will be peace? The, the cycle, cycle will end. The Reapers will cease their harvest. And the civilizations preserved in their forms will be connected to all of us. Synthesis is the final evolution of all life. The paths are open. But you have to choose. Well, there's your choices. Alright. So. Uh, I'm going to have annotations on the screen for that ending, that ending, that ending, and another ending. So, click the annotation and the ending you want to watch. Because, obviously, I'm not going to please anyone. Like, I have all these viewers, there's no way I'm pleasing everyone with my choice, so... I'm gonna do all of them, and, uh, I'm gonna do mine last. Um... Yeah, so thank you all for watching, and click the link. Peace out.